Nice and warm. Is it warm? Yes. Just cold, tell daddy, and I'll put some more hot water. String, but they don't go downwards. They definitely don't like to go downwards. They don't like going down, boy. <laughs> they don't go downwards. Um, they always want to go up. Sorrel doesn't look too happy. Okay, I'm gonna have to neutralize that. Put some neutrals in there. Anyway, the garden this year has been good. All the height of the fever few stuff, it's just beautiful to hear those kids playing in that thing. All the height of the fever few stuff, um, they've died down now, back to this. Didn't have much potatoes, uh, I made, I don't know what happened. And the king's flowers came up, we got those, when we first met we got those flowers there from Hampton Court. They just look like the right place for King so I thought take them yeah, off. And they've been growing ever since. Five years or whatever. They've actually grown. They've been growing. Alright, uh, what else do I tell you here? The purple shoots, Brat and Brocky, they were the best. They were just the best things to open the season with. Because they, uh, Daddy, they were um, beautiful. I did a big job. Well, good did you? What, what's this, Daddy? What's this? <laughs> oh, what a big jump. Oh, oh, what a lovely big jump. It's so big you're nearly in space. Uh, we've got tomatoes going there, and they're actually writing. But, experiment. If you notice, I've put that tomato by the side of the compost box. This, has been, this tomato's been growing a long time before it. Look at the size of that tomato plant. It's stretched out. It's gone berserk. Now she's clipped the heads off of it as well, but it's still taken, it's still grown fully. You know that I can use somebody else. So like you and all you know. And the tomatoes are actually coming through lovely. And yeah, they're really coming through. So that is something obviously nutrients. Give more food, get more plant. Not happening. <laughs> so in amongst all this anyway, we managed to squeeze a pool in. After those girls, anything, mate. They got a man as a daddy. Real man. And I got real kids. We have corn coming there. There you go. First pod there. We have chilies there. We have Jamaican spinach still coming. Very low this year. Something not quite right about us. Well, I'll work on that because that's my department. Unless I'm told different. Peppers again. This oak tree has just been there. 
<laughs> or is it stereo Lisa? Mono Lisa. Well, are you guys not bored already? Oh, they're bumping, they're dumping in the bath. Yeah, is it warm? Hot. hot. Good. It's like a hot bath outside your house, is it? Lisa. Oh, no. Lisa. Oh, no, Lisa. <laughs> They should have. Gracie, I heard that sneeze. Do that corn's coming. Uh, mint, I've had, I've stopped drinking coffee. I've had the most mint from that. I'm looking. Yeah, it's two beautiful girls. Yeah. yeah. We had most mint, mints come there, we cut the avocado tree right back and it's starting to take again. Those tomatoes though, they are not, they're not having it. That'd be horrible to her. Oh, you went all the way to 16 there and done a big jump. That was a long count. Just counted. No, mind you hurt her though. No, no, no. Mind you hurt her. Mind you hurt each other. So the, the, the potatoes was a waste of time. Potatoes on the roof, well they weren't a waste of time, but we didn't get that much. A waste of time. <laughs> and uh, that's it, EJ's upstairs, leaping. Battery's out, can't recall anymore. We've um, eaten out there and that garlic is sleeping. Some kind of a bulb coming out of this garlic. That was on my feet and that really done well. So we have had a good run out of it. It's more at the back. <laughs> <laughs>